well, it's about 8.30 in the morning, and uh, temperature is about 58 degrees, and um, it is the perfect time to go out and work on the bees. Um, I need to add another medium, and um, look at the hive, make sure it's doing okay and everything, but um, yeah, it's the perfect temperature to do it right now, so... Um, all right, well, I'm going to go ahead and pause this, and we'll get out there in a second. Well, as you can see, it being so cold, they're all inside there. Usually, right about now, they're all out here, but it's not even 60 degrees yet. So, this will be good. Good timing to do this. Try to get a nice little video close-up. See all that propolis? Looks like they're probably definitely ready to get this uh, new medium on here. But they're pretty calm. They're just investigating me. I can smell all the pheromones and everything from us working on it before. And you can probably smell the propolis and the bee, or in the honey on the tool. <clears throat> I'm not sure if that's exactly right, but is. I'm still learning, but beekeeping. Once you uh, once you start, it's pretty addicting. It's it's cool. Um, I mean, we we haven't had any issues yet. So, knock on wood. Knocking on wood right now. So, all right. Let's take this top board off and uh, see inside. So I figured I wouldn't really be that long, but. I guess any time I take a video, I'm taking long, so I decided not to smoke them this time because I figured it would just be pretty quick, but um, they're getting just a little bit irritated. I think the fact that it's cool outside is helping. All right. Here, here's the comb. They're building that comb nice and up. They're filling this with some honey. That's nice. That's well, looking pretty good in there. Take a look at the center frame though. Tells me I go too fast, so I'm trying to go slow. Oh. Maybe you'll see that bee across the lens. There's a bee on the camera. All right, let's see what we got here. That's capped. Alright, so they're capping. Starting to cap this center one. So this one, this one, this one, this one. So these ones right here are getting capped. These four right here are getting capped. So the one underneath is definitely probably all capped off. Because it was almost all capped off last time so all right well they're doing good so instead of ticking them off even more I'm gonna go ahead and put this medium this new medium on and then leave them be <laughs> pun intended again I amused myself so last time when we did this we put because this is a 10 frame medium we put 10 frames in 
but when they were camping the cap didn't go very deep the cap just went almost up to the wooden rim right there so it was a little difficult to cap we didn't have too much waste but we had more than we wanted so we're just going to put nine frames and we put nine frames in the other ones to see how they do and it seems like the hive has more room to grow on the outside and when it grows more when it grows deeper um, it'll be easier just to run a hot knife or run a bread knife right down the center to decap it I found that a bread knife works really good some people use a oh, excuse me the morning burps some people use uh, electric carving knives but uh, we have this knife that we got from the miscellaneous barn and um, it works really well for uncapping All right, so I'm just going to spread this out here I'm trying to get I have to hold this camera right up in front of my face while I'm doing this so I have this chest mount that works pretty good but I'm too tall for what this is but I, they have these these glasses they're high def video glasses I'd like to get them and uh, that way we can definitely see everything I'm doing so all right well these bees here are ticked off enough so uh, let's just put them back on here it's kind of funny when the bees come close to my face I know that they're not gonna be able to get me but I still close my lips for some reason every time I was uh, oops sorry bee every time you know bug comes close to me I close up my lips and since I usually never stop talking I just kind of tighten my lips a little bit and so I still do it so let's see if we can get one of these bees to crawl up, crawl up on me here maybe want to crawl up on me hmm when I'm an intruder or unless I'm your friend all right never mind all right I'm gonna pause this real quick so I need both hands to put this top bar on all right well there it is a little brood and a little bit of honey that has honey that has honey and then that one right there we're gonna work on getting honey right there I think that'll be there um, winter Honey, I'm not sure. I have to talk with the boss, um, aka the wife. So, I hope you enjoyed this video.